Hey everyone, Kaylee here with Micro Survey, and in today's video, we are going to use Field Genius for Android to solve a property dispute. So uh, recently, uh, we had a minor property dispute with our neighbors, um, and I'm gonna take the opportunity here with a real-world example to uh, to kind of see how it unfolds. So basically. I will give you a bit of background uh, about what's going on and then we can uh, bring out the GPS and uh, and get this uh, get this situation solved I guess so we got a text from our tenant um, who was complaining about the neighbors uh, using her driveway um, and then pulling in between our house and the neighbor's house along the neighbor's fence to access a shed they have in the backyard. Um, we, uh, we went and spoke to them and uh, she said that the property line actually is eight feet on our side of the fence so there's more than enough room for a car to um, pull in between uh, alongside the fence there. Um, our argument being it doesn't matter where the, the, the PL is, um, don't use our driveway. Um, so just for curiosity, uh, ev the, everything's been worked through and they're accessing the shed from the other side. But just out of curiosity, of course, I have to go and um, find the pins. So I did go out and do some poking around. I have found three of the four pins and it does look like the pin in the front is about eight feet over from the fence line but the catch is is that the fence does not run parallel to the property line uh, the fence and the house is angled so it starts out eight feet um, across from the fence in the front but it looks like it tapers off to a point in the back corner wasn't able to find the back corner so what I did was I shot in the uh, three pins I could find and then I'm going to use a Kogo function in uh, Field Genius for Android just to kind of give me an approximate location of where that third pin would have been and I'm just gonna put um, a marker in the ground for my own personal uh, for my own personal reasons <laughs> Okay, so I just shot in the three pins I was able to find, and uh, now I'm going to use the calculated position from Field Genius for Android to stake out the missing corner and see kind of a visual of where this property line falls. Okay, the next thing I'm going to do is use Field Genius for Android to calculate out a line that I'm able to stake between the front and back property pins um, on that shared property line. Once that line is created, I simply tap on it and then hit stake line. And then the program is going to tell me how far I need to go right or left to get centered on the line.
Okay, so we got the survey done and it looks like, yes, there is uh, quite a bit of room on that side of the fence. However, there is not enough room to get a car in between the uh, property line and the fence once you get back to the back end of the property. So, uh, I'll just flip this around for you guys to see. And uh, that's it for today's video.